pardon the mess, we just got ourselves a Reef Link. So we're going to do an unboxing right now. Introducing Reef Link. Reef Link setup. Let's see this card here. Plug in your Reef Link to a computer with a supplied USB cable, no power, and allow drivers to be installed if necessary. Okay, so not exactly plug it in and forget about it, but it sounds pretty easy. I'm going to try and figure it out. Okay, plug it in with the USB cable. That's not USB. This is USB with no power. That's kind of uh, misleading. USB has power. Huh. White lights. I don't know. Good or bad. Installing device drivers. Click here for status. Tick tock, tick tock. I don't know what's going on. If necessary. If necessary. I read this now. If necessary. Download and run the ReefLink setup application at tiny.cc ReefLink. Okay, let's do that. Download for Windows. Okay, yeah, let's do it. Set up, zip. Yeah, sure, put an executable on my system. What's concerning to me is that there's a troubleshooting section on this side of the card, much bigger than the instructions. How many things can go wrong with this? Seems fairly straightforward. Log into your EcoSmart Live account. Please wait a moment. Oh, how will you connect your ReefLink to the internet? I'm going to say wireless. Even though I have the option to go Ethernet, I'm going to go wireless. Found a whole bunch of wireless networks. Found my network. And now I have like a crazy long password to put in. Please perform these steps below, then click done. Disconnect your reef link from the computer. Okay. Power on your reef link. Oh, pretty rainbow. Once your reef link is powered, EcoSmart Live will wait until it hears from your reef link. It says it's blue. I'm guessing that means we're good. Waiting for reef link to reconnect. Could it really be this easy? I, I'm hoping so, yeah. A little concerning. Still waiting for ReefLink to reconnect. Hmm. Connection error! Yay! Time to go to that troubleshooting section. Not helpful. Of course, I'm always crabby when things don't go right. I'm going to love it once I finally get it working. Okay, one of the options after trying again twice, once, two times total that I'm actually going through the process of trying to get this thing to connect is to start over. I'm going to start over. I'm tempted to say Ethernet. Not working! I should be much happier than I am right now. I'm going to try rebooting. Factory reset? Sure. Let's do a firmware update. This is being a huge pain in the butt. So shouldn't have taken this long. Well, the status bar is like this big out of this much on my computer. Thinking for like 
three or four minutes already, so. Okay, I've been going crazy. Something's wacky. I've been playing with this for like an hour and a half. But the good news is, check this out. Okay, this isn't good news yet, but. See this? Please wait a moment while your reflink, reflink initiates. I've been killing myself forever. Forever. But despite that, went into my app. You watching this with me? Yeah, it's working. Even though the desktop is like giving me all these errors, it's working. Now I just want Vortec control, please. Please give me Vortec control. Ah, <sighs> toys. They're so much fun. I'm happy that I have this overall. There's a lot of bugs that still need to be worked out, but their original claim of just plug it in, turn it on, apparently it's true, but there is a whole bunch of red tape, at least at the, the time of recording this video. Error message, error message, error message. There's things saying two different things, but you know what my advice is? Shortest part of the video. Plug it in, ignore the errors, Open the app on your smartphone or mobile device and see if it works. I don't know what made me do it because I'm usually one of those guys that like wants to make sure that everything is perfect before I go ahead and try it, but part of the troubleshooting this time around was just like, man, just see what happens and guess what? It worked. So anyways, I hope this was helpful for you. Please don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe or just pick one. Thanks for watching.